previous clip um i ate breakfast i think that was sunday so uh, yeah i just washed my face and like did everything um almost skincare like related and stuff so i kind of feel like i need a more deeper cleanse today so i'm going to be using this mask that was sent over to me all the details will be down below in the description box and on the screen um, anything I leave out about the mask, I will probably just do a voiceover on this, but I already opened it and kind of like smelt it and I don't really do things with like a scent, but this one, I don't know. It just smells really good. I don't know. <laughs> so yeah, this is the consistency of it. Um, this is my second time actually using this mask. Um... I used it once last week. I like to keep it on for about five to ten minutes. Let me take out my AirPod. I like to keep it on for about five to ten minutes. Um, I just used one of my old flat foundation makeup brushes to put it on. Um, I do have an actual brush for <laughs> facials, like mask and stuff, but I forgot where I... <laughs> Excuse, excuse Prince. 
I forgot where I put it, where I put it when I moved. So I really love that the mask is all natural. It's an organic coconut charcoal mask. Um, it is handmade from Africa and it is formulated especially for black women and brown skin tones. Unlike most of the, you know, skincare products out there, you know. <laughs> But you can use my name for a promo code Akira. You'll get free shipping and they also have different promotions going on for 30% off. So you do not want to miss that, honey. And like I said, I kept this on for about five minutes. If I would have did a thicker coat, I would have left it on a lot longer. But I like that it went on very cool. It feels really good and the scent didn't affect my skin. Um, I'm not really one to have a sensitive type of skin my skin is very dry um after i used my moisturizer and stuff i was perfectly fine but yeah i really do recommend this product i like that it is you know especially made for us black women so check the link down in my description box below for all of the promo codes and yeah The mask has been on for about almost 10 minutes and it dries up pretty well. I don't like to use a thick layer of mask because that's just not my preference. Everything is dry except for this part right here, but I'm going to go ahead and rinse it off because I'm like moving too much and it's making it break and stuff. So yeah, if you like a thicker layer, thicker layer, you can definitely do that. Or if you're trying to do like a spa day, um, usually I always leave my mask on for a lot longer than like five to 10 minutes. But it doesn't take long to dry at all. Like I said, it's almost been 10 minutes and it's pretty much dry. Depending on how thick you make it, of course. Um, I can never put my face in the sink and rinse it off. I don't know, like, when I do that, it's just like I drown myself. Comment down below if y'all can do that or not. So I always have to use a, um, a towel to, like, rinse off my face mask or like any skincare product type thing sometimes i can do that with my cleanser like i can put my face in the uh, sink and like just splash it up but i don't know something like this i can't do it because it's like i'm drowning myself off i'm just finishing up with a moisturizer and a um spf and yeah she looks good minus my random little dark marks marks and stuff hey y'all <laughs> so i think this is the first time i'm showing my face in this vlog what y'all had seen earlier was i think me actually on sunday making breakfast um i worked three days well three nights in a row and i just got up today is wednesday um all i did sunday monday tuesday was work go to sleep maybe tidy up a little bit and go to sleep um i'm about to actually go to the local pet store it's called pet sense here and i am about to go get print some medicine i woke up to him throwing up on my little ottoman um i wiped the spot so right there and over there he kind of threw up so i am locked up in the cage right now because obviously i don't want him to throw up anywhere else <laughs> so i'm about to go to the store and see what they got last time this happened um all i do is literally feed him white rice and chicken breast nothing added in it um works every time and the vet always tells me to do that but the last time he was actually having like oh you still up here no you bet the last time he was actually having um like bad diarrhea so when he pooped yesterday it wasn't it was still solid but it was a little i don't know if it's tmi it was still if this tmi skip <laughs> it was a little solid but it was like still a little bit running so i don't know it she like this don't bother me because obviously i work in healthcare. <laughs> so yeah i'm about to go buy the diarrhea control and see if that settles everything um unless they have something else like specifically just for an upset stomach so um, my baby's sick again i'm about to um i think i'm a well he don't normally eat until a few hours so when i come back i'm gonna put on some rice for him all of my chicken breast is completely frozen so uh I'm going to spend the rest of today cleaning probably. Um, I may put in some clips, but 
yeah i'm just going to clean up my mess and try to straighten up stuff i still have like trash to take out so i'm going to take out some trash when i go and then if i go somewhere else today i'll take out another thing of trash so yeah what i got to clean up literally is just make hold on i literally just gotta make my bed i'm going to um work on my closet like rearrange it and stuff not really rearrange but just put it in order because literally i just threw everything in there my bathroom's clean the living room like i said i still have like boxes and trash to take out so yeah and then my youtube studio back there baby we're not even gonna talk about it <laughs> i'm actually gonna put up my um mirrors and stuff tonight so that part will actually look a little bit better and then once that's done i can probably start working on everything else and getting everything else in place so i'm gonna open this a little bit but yeah that's what i'm doing for today um i'll get back in with y'all either later today or tomorrow because i actually want to do a full like clean with me video so yeah i probably won't include it in this vlog but tomorrow i'm going to try to go find my couch and i'll insert right now the um couch that i originally was going to get right here and then the couch that i recently found but the couch that i recently found literally i don't want it to take up too much let me turn the light i don't want it to take up too much of the living room because it is a big sectional so i'm gonna take measurements here and then i'm gonna go and try to get the measurements from them but yeah i've been talking for three four minutes so see y'all later okay so i just got back from the store i think i recorded a little clip on my phone but i got me some first off lighting is ugly <laughs> okay i don't have my ring light so we just gonna have to make do with it so i just got back got my starbies my order period I'm here up and eat. I got me some chick chick. And I'm about to um put print some rice on so I can put some of this diarrhea control in there. It works like a charm. And of course, in there looking around, we got these. Um, I used to feed him this brand of treats when I was training him. Um, these are the training treats that I fed him to train him. <laughs> so yeah, he really loves these. He used to eat these as a puppy. So I'm about to um, plug up my rice maker, off, cook up some rice. So, uh, hey y'all, it's later in the day and I'm actually, my battery is about to die soon, but I'm about to cook pasta. Haven't cooked pasta in a while, so I hope it turns out right, but there's all my ingredients. I'm trying to do a little TikTok and you know, stuff like that. So here's my seasonings, got that going in there and then I'm about to season the meat and my sausages. There's this place locally that makes their pasta with like bacon bits in it. So that's how I'm going to do mine. I really, really, really enjoyed it that way. So I'm going to do sausages and bacon because we need all the gains we can get, period. I'm going to put mine in the oven first because that's how I've always cooked mine. And then once they're about done in there, then I'm going to put them on the stove and then I'm going to fry them all up in here and then i didn't season them yet i'm gonna season them when i season everything else looking for prints literally this whole time like i'm like okay he's not in the cage if he's under the bed usually he'll run out by now he's not in my closet i didn't check that i vacuumed the floor cleaned up everything i've done he i've been doing stuff for at least an hour and a half almost two hours i come open the door to my bathroom so i can pee why is he right here on the rug 
I'm like, why didn't you whine or bark or something? In there, in the dark, just sitting there for at least almost two hours. <laughs> Mama, sorry, baby boy. I didn't know your ass was in there. Like, what were you doing? That is the most funniest thing ever. The most funniest thing ever. I'm carrying around my big ass tripod because I'm trying to record me cooking. So if it's shaky, this why, because I got this long ass thing. But yeah, I'm gonna use the bathroom, finish cooking and shower and get ready to watch some movies. tomorrow so I'm about to try to fit my old couch in my beauty room I'm going to put it over here on this wall and they said they'll probably be here from like anywhere from one or four in the evening uh, I could have got it today but literally I just went and picked up the couch and like I said I could have got it today but I really wasn't trying to rush back home to like move everything out the way and then move the couch back here and all this jazz. So I'm like, just come tomorrow. Plus I had other stuff I had to go do. So I'm about to try to make me a little passageway to put my couch in my YouTube room. Um, one thing about the couch is it's a sectional L shape. So the L shape I think is gonna be closer to the door and I wish it was flipped. And the couch, you can't like take it apart and flip it to the other side. So, I don't know how it's gonna look. I may have to like switch the, I don't know, we're gonna see tomorrow, but it is an L shape and it's not on the side that I want it, I would prefer it to be on. So I don't know, I may try to shift it or whatever, but I'm about to move all of this stuff out the way. Um, my love seat is not heavy. It's just, I have hardwood floors and I don't wanna scoot it on its legs because it'll scratch up the floor most likely. So I'm probably just gonna have to like scoot it really slow. Um, I don't have anyone here right now that can help me like pick it up. And plus I didn't know that I was just gonna randomly get up and get my couch and shit. So that's my struggle. something one thing for certain two things for sure i ain't no weak ass bitch okay and that's just that on that so as of right now i'm going to keep the couch um if it becomes to be a problem take up too much room get on my nerves whatever the case may be or i just don't want it anymore i will sell it but for right now this is going to be where I do my sit down video. So if y'all see me on this couch, it is my sit down videos. Um, I may or may not sometimes go into the living room, but I'm glad to have something in here designated for this. Um, 
I'll probably move my vanity closer over. I don't know. Because I want Prince's bed to be in here. And I had it in the corner. But I don't want him in the corner, so. I just gave him a bath. <laughs> so now he's running around like crazy. <laughs> <laughs> so I got my new couch, you guys. <laughs> he was like, "Are you a you a fashion? I don't know, fashion something, I guess." Cause I mean, obviously, I'm something. And he saw, saw the ring light. So this is my couch. It is um freaking huge. <laughs> I hate that the L shape. I don't know, cause at first they was gonna do it this way but i'm like it makes sense to do it this way but it's so freaking long that it comes past this like i didn't take measurements like i said i was so i don't really like how it comes past Ugh, prince is crying she wants to come out so yeah i'm gonna move the rug a little bit off of there and then straight down that way but yeah this is my couch let me turn on the ring light. So, all these pillows came with the couch. Super cute. This one came with it. Your girl can relax and chillax on her new couch. So, get down. Down. <laughs> so, now when I have company, people can chill. More than two people can sit down. And I can chill and watch my TV. So, this is the way I'm going to have to have it because if I put it that way, you're not going to be able to. Um Since it is a black couch, I'm going to use this lint roller because some of the fur from the pillows is on here and literally just because it is a black couch. <laughs> so you can see. So here's my dilemma. I have Prince bed. Um, the couch is bigger than I expected, but I really, really love it. So I have um, his bed and it was over there. So now I don't know where I'm gonna put it. I guess where his toys is at right here. Um, I was gonna get some chairs to place over here, but literally the couch is perfect size, so I don't need to. So basically I'm working with what's over here. So let me sweep up this trash real quick. this little toy basket and put his bed right over here so literally he can look at what's going on um these 
these shoes I'm gonna put in my room. And I'm gonna move all of this. keep that right there for now i don't really know where i want stuff um i don't know what i'm gonna i'm probably gonna sell this because obviously i don't need it anymore um yeah so i'm gonna keep print stuff right here i gotta move that random stuff and i guess i won't put anything over here because i don't want the living room to be too crowded so i may or may not even move this table but um, we're gonna see. So basically my living room is done. Um, I just have to get my TV mounted. I'm gonna go find a little bit more wall decor. Like I want something right here. I feel like this wall is pretty okay with that one. Um, maybe something over here. And I also still have, if you watched my apartment haul, I still have those. So I don't know where I want to put this. Um, I was thinking maybe over here, but I kind of want something that says something about like the kitchen. So then I was like, I can put it somewhere in the living room. So I don't know where my room, I don't know. Y'all tell me where I should put these. I got that blank wall. I got some more wall over here. Um, I don't want it in my bedroom. I want it actually out. So where could I put those? Comment down below where you think I should put them.